What's up, people? So today I got a session with my guy, Jonathan. He's coming in to lay some guitar. So I wanted you guys to kind of get an inside look on the process and just how we, you know, created and vibed out. Uh, so yeah, a little vlog, I guess. And um, yeah, so enjoy and let's get this work in. <laughs> a little early 
um, if you can kind of slide into into the slow and the measure, so it does come in. Second is uh the first one I like I, I like it too. Yeah. It has that um um you could play with melodic stuff in uh but the second was more of a of a upbeat. Mm -hmm. And um the horns make it like glorious. Yeah yeah. Da -da, da -da, da -da. Yeah. Da -da, da -da, da -da. Yep. So yeah, yeah, I think, I think they're gonna, I think they're gonna eat them up. Um, we should get a lot of a lot of uses out of that. Um, hopefully year round. I mean, well, especially with the guitar, you know, football. Maybe even um, it may even kind of transition into you know some other some other sports um, that's more guitar driven. Bro. Um, oh, appreciate it. I feel like guitar just takes takes things to the next level. Like sonically, it's just. It's a different energy. Like you can only, I mean, you can do a lot on keys, but if you really want that edge, man, guitar is where it's at. <laughs> but you see, everything you did, I can't do. <laughs> I can't do. That's true. I can't do on the guitar. Like the, yeah. you can't do drums on guitar. Or, no, bro. I mean. No, I mean all the sounds, all the, the horns, all the arrangements, pianos, uh, strings. Right. right. Uh, well, you you got drumming and you have everything, bro. Bro, I'm glad I'm glad I was able to to help out, bro, and not only help out but start working together, man. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. We'll, um, we'll make we'll make it a habit. <laughs> <laughs> I appreciate it, bro. <laughs> so we just finished up the dude literally just like murdered everything i threw at him like we did two joints um sending it out for sports um so 
yeah, shout out to Jonathan, man. He did his thing. If, if you're an artist or a musician and you record a lot in the studio, uh, you can't be afraid to make mistakes. Like a lot of times we would just hit record and just be like, yo, whatever comes out is what it is. If it's whack, we will delete it and we'll just do it again. Um, so you can't be afraid to give it your all and just and do your best and you can't be afraid to mess up most importantly I think a lot of times um, even working with artists and, and musicians and things like that um, there's like this this fear of messing up like I don't want to mess up I'm recording I don't want to mess up even myself if I'm recording vocals or recording myself playing for whatever reason when I hit record it's like the pressure's on but you can't be afraid to mess up, especially since we have technology. If you mess up, delete it, do it again, and keep it moving. Um, if you worked in a session with me before, if you're an artist that I work with, a musician, I laugh at mistakes. If you mess up and it's funny, I'ma laugh, I'ma laugh, I'ma laugh at you. It's all fun, man. It's, it's Nobody's like overly critical. I know you can sing, you know you can sing. I know you can rap, you know you can rap. I know you can play, you know you can play. So it is what it is. Let's have fun, let's make mistakes until we get that perfect take. So I'm out, I'm about to get to working the mixing and all of that good stuff on these tracks so we can shoot them out and hopefully get some placements, man. So hopefully y'all hear these joints on um, you know some sports networks or your favorite teams, football, game, pre-show, Post show stats, highlights, things like that. So, yeah, I'm out. Y'all be easy. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Peace.